Hello everyone! Welcome back to Technique 4 Tutorials. In this video, I'll show you how to add an extension in Loggy app. Let's begin! First, let's understand some benefits of adding extensions in the Loggy browser. With the help of extension, we can improve our work. For example, Grammarly helps to improve in writing, email writing, content, and blog. Now let's start on how to add extensions in the profile browser. We will see how to download the extension first for our profile browser. Let's go to the Chrome browser, search Chrome Extension Source Viewer, then click on it. Then click on Add to Chrome button. Next, click Add Extension. Then wait for the notification that says it was added successfully. Now click on the extension icon to check it out. And here we have the Chrome extension source viewer added. Now click on pin. Now let's add an extension in my profile browser. And first, I want to add Grammarly. So I will search and click on it and add it to Chrome. Now on the top right corner, we have an option here. Click on it and select download as zip and it will take a few seconds to download so just wait on it then you will see it on the bottom left corner downloaded as a zip file let's rename it first before we extract it after that again right click on your mouse and select extract to grammarly extension after that Let's now go to our Loggy app profile browser. Under Actions, click on the Extensions button. Click on Add Extension. Click to choose your extension folder. Then select your folder. Then you will see that the extension has been added to your profile. Now let's check if this extension is indeed added or not. Click on the extension button again, and now you can see that Grammarly for Chrome is added to my profile browser. Now click on the browser icon to open. Let's check if this extension is working for my browser or not. So let's open some editor. Click on Google Apps and select on Docs. Create a new one. And here you will see that Grammarly for Chrome is working for me. And that is how you add an extension in your Loggy app profile browser. I hope you find this video helpful. And in the next video, I'll show you how to add a proxy to Loggy browser. Thanks for watching and see you on the next one.